Sony has announced a new virtual reality headset for the PlayStation 4 as the battle of the game's consoles looks set to focus on immersive technologies. The eagerly awaited device will allow gamers to play a lineup of titles on their PS4 including Batman and Star Wars when it launches in October. It comes as Microsoft announced it was focusing its efforts on a new high-powered games console, codenamed Project Scorpio, that will work specifically with virtual reality when it launches next year. Xbox players are already able to play games using Facebook's Oculus Rift VR headset and many other technology companies are rushing to produce virtual reality headsets. PlayStation's announcement, however, is the first VR headset to be designed to work specifically with a games console. Sony chairman, Sean Layden, made the announcement at the Shrine Auditorium in Los Angeles. The virtual reality headsets will be available from October 13, for the price of $399 in the US, and $349 in the UK. Sony late last year cut the price of its PS4, making the console available for $350 in the US and $299.99 in the UK. Microsoft also made a similar move, lowering the Xbox One price to $350 in the US and $299.99 in the UK by unbundling it from a Kinect motion sensing accessory. Speaking to the BBC, games industry analyst Lewis Ward, said, It's not for the faint of heart in terms of the type of game experiences they're going for, it's really that hardcore ethos. Despite trends toward play on smartphones, tablets, and personal computers, industry heavyweights are not giving up consoles which have long ruled the lucrative sector. The PlayStation VR headset has been designed to be as light and as comfortable as possible. On their website, Sony said, it's effortless to slip on and off, while its minimal weight is supported by an adjustable headband that'll fit everyone. Sony headed into the E3 conference as a market leader, having sold more than 40 million PS4 consoles since they launched in late 2013. As well as announcing the headset, Sony provided glimpses at coming PS4 titles including a new God of War, along with Spider-Man, and Days Gone. Sony promised more than 50 games for PlayStation VR will be available within months after the launch, among them zombie shooter Resident Evil, one based on the iconic Star Wars franchise, and another on the comic book Dark Knight Batman.